Hi everyone, I'm Natasha Lester, author of The Paris Secret. I thought it might be fun to show you my office where I write all my books. So come inside. So my first favourite thing about my office is my Florence Broadhurst wallpaper, which was the very first thing I chose when I was setting up this office about mm, 10 years ago now, and I still love it as much as I did when I first chose it. When I walk into my office every morning, the pink and the silver and the blue just make me feel good from the very first moment. The other thing I love about my office is my entire wall of books. Um, obviously, every writer loves to read, so every writer should have a wall of books in their office space to inspire them as they write. And this is my inspiration wall. So I always have picks up here that relate to the book I'm writing. So right now I'm writing a book for 2021 with a working title of the Riviera House. So there are lots of picks that kind of make me feel like I'm back in the French Riviera. And this is my beautiful painting that I have on my wall in my office. It's by a local WA artist called Laurie Pensini. And I just love the way that um, this girl looks as she's reading her book. And that's kind of how I imagine or hope that my readers might feel when they're reading one of my books. The other thing I knew I always wanted in my office was doors that open to the outside. So I could have those open and feel like I was kind of you know, in the outside, because I always find being outside having fresh air is very inspiring and good for creativity. So I have these doors open most days when I'm working and I love just sitting there looking at the, the green or the yellow leaves in autumn and things like that. The last thing about my office that I love is this chair right here where I sit down and read a lot. Um, so it's a perfect place to read a book like The Paris Secret. And there's one more thing about my office that I thought I'd show you, so let's go downstairs. Like many people are doing at the moment, I'm also supervising three kids who are doing school from home at the moment. Hi kids!